Now the wait is nearly over for the thousands of Asian athletes who will be aiming for gold at the 17th Asian Games in Incheon. The opening ceremony will for the uh, region's largest sporting event is just two days away now. Our Song Jisan checks in on the athletes and the plans for opening night. Athletes from all over Asia are descending upon Incheon as the clock ticks toward the opening ceremony of the 17th Asian Games on Friday. South Korea's biggest team ever at over 8,000 athletes and officials have already begun unpacking in Incheon, while North Korea's main ASEA delegation arrived on Tuesday. The North delegation will hold a flag-raising ceremony at the athletes' village at 10 a.m. on Thursday, while the South Korean athletes will hold their own at 4 p.m. As for today's action, South Korea's men's and women's football squads will hold their second preliminaries at 8 p.m. against Saudi Arabia and India, respectively. In the meantime, the South baseball team, which is defending its title from Guangzhou 2010, began training for their first game against Thailand on Monday evening. The Korean baseball organization is taking a two-week break to allow for its players to compete in the Asian Games. KBO action will pick back up at the start of next month with the home stretch for the race toward the playoffs. South Korean fencer Nam hyun and archer Oh jin hyo will be representing the 13,000 participants on the opening night of the Asian Games 2014. But we still don't know who will be lighting the Asian Games torch at the opening ceremony. The flame has been traveling around Korea for a month now and will be passed around the host city of Incheon on Wednesday before finding a new home at the main stadium on Friday. Song Ji-sun, Arirang News.